Hello there Capricorn and Capricorn Rising. This is going to be your October love reading for the month of October. What we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and cut these cards and we're going to see exactly what wants to come out in, term, in, in terms of the energies of this month and in terms of what's going to go on moving forward, okay? So I'm going to just keep on cutting these cards for you guys and we're just going to see exactly what wants to come out. And honest to goodness, there's going to be some things. We're going to go ahead and just put those cards over there. We're going to just keep on cutting these cards for you guys and just see what wants to come out here. We don't want those cards in either. So we're just going to go ahead and just keep on cutting these cards here for you guys. And just keep on going here. This card actually really seems like it wants to come out. And we're just going to go ahead and just keep on going here. Oh my goodness gracious, we've got We've got this card that sort of kind of wanted to fling over here. And I actually feel like, no, it actually feels sort of kind of like that. So we're going to just keep on going here. Uh, and then we're going to just keep on cutting these cards and seeing what wants to come out here. Oh, okay. I'm actually feeling, um, um, I actually do not feel that, it doesn't seem like that. Um, let's see, um, nah, no, we're not doing that. Cool. Let's go ahead and just see what is going to go on for tonight. Okay, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and just see what's going on tonight, and we're just gonna go ahead and just check and see. Here, here's some cards here. And we are going to go ahead and just put them out just like that. So there we go for you guys. Uh, it's Capricorn and Capricorn Rising. Let's go ahead and see what is going to go on in terms of the energies of this month for you guys, okay? The first card here is the Seven of Wands, saying that honest to goodness, this this is going to be a love that's really going to require you to really traverse some distance, to sort of kind of go through that portal, and to really, really start feeling that really great energy that honest to goodness is completely and totally meant to be felt by you. This is going to be an absolutely wonderful, wonderful, wonderful situation. It's really going to be able to allow you to feel amazing, be able to feel like everything's working out for you, and be able to feel like things are honest to goodness progressing down the right path. The next card here is a Knight of Cups upside down, which is just saying a little bit about how this is going to really allow your emotions to start feeling good. Wherever you sort of kind of trek down that path, you're really going to be able to find out that your emotions are going to start getting healed. And I really mean that in a very, very big, big way. You're going to be able to have that wonderful, wonderful energy that honest to goodness is all about that wonderful emotion, wonderful healing, just a wonderful, wonderful situation. Uh, the next card here is the Ace of Cups, also in reverse, talking a little bit about the, these emotions becoming healed. There's going to be so much situations that are really going to be able to allow your emotions to feel better, emotions to feel good, emotions to feel like they're, 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 they are they're 100% in check. And honest to goodness, whenever these situations start coming out like that, you're, you're really, really going to be able to find out that honest to goodness, there's going to be some wonderful, wonderful, wonderful energy that's just going to sort of kind of catapult you exactly where you want to be. With the Eight of Cups as well, we're talking about really moving to a new height. Moving somewhere absolutely fantastic, moving somewhere wonderful, moving somewhere that honest to goodness 100% uh, is meant to be. Watch out for all these wonderful situations because honest to goodness, these are going to be big ones. And whenever I mean big ones, I say big ones, big ones, big ones, big ones, big ones. The Seven of Swords is also talking a little bit about you finally being able to sort of kind of get something that you would like in terms of third quarter of the month. And I really feel that like being getting something that you want in terms of your emotions. Feeling good, feeling great, feeling like everything is A-OK -okay and all right. This is going to be the time for you to start feeling that way. This is going to be the time for you to start feeling good, feeling great, and feeling like everything, honest to goodness, is going to plan. Now, the next card here is the Three of Cups, saying that honest to goodness, you're going to be able to start having a little bit more fun. You're going to be able to start feeling good, feeling like everything is honest to goodness, just working out, and just feeling just feeling happy, feeling like things are honest to goodness, just feeling great. This is going to be a time for you to really start experiencing this wonderful, wonderful energy that's really going to allow you to start moving forward. And moving forward, you will, because especially with the Three of Cups here, you're going to be able to start experiencing happiness. You're going to be able to start experiencing fun and joy. And joy is going to be a big, 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 big situation in, in, in terms of your month. Because this is going to be a time for all those lovebirds out there just start feeling joy and feeling like you've honest to goodness really got something that's very, very, very important for you. The next card here is the Lover's Card, saying that yes, in terms of the fourth quarter of the month, it's all about love. It's love, 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 love. And you're really going to be able to experience that wonderful love energy that's honest to goodness all about you, all about these wonderful situations, just all about great, great, great feelings, great, great things, and just great, great situations all around. 
you're gonna be able to start feeling good and start feeling like everything is working out for you because honest to goodness it is uh capricorn the lover's card is all about that and it's all about this wonderful energy wonderful sweeping energy that's just gonna make you feel amazing feel like everything is right for you and feel like things are all going to plan the Five of Wands is also talking a little bit about your energy being able to flow. And your energy is really going to be able to start flowing because, honest to goodness, this is going to be the time for you to be able to start feeling great, feeling wonderful, and feeling like everything is, honest to goodness, going your way. This energy is going to be flowing in the right direction, flowing uh, flowing perfectly is what, the way that I really feel like. And you're going to be able to experience this wonderful energy going all the way, okay? So feel love, feel happy, and feel like everything is, honest to goodness, working out for you guys because most definitely... Definitely it is, okay? So feel great and feel like everything's doing wonderful because you, you guys are going to have an absolutely fantastic month, especially especially at the very end of the month here. We're honest to goodness here, here you're going to be able to start experiencing this wonderful, wonderful, wonderful love and energy and be able to feel like everything is really just honest to goodness continuing the way that it should and everything is honest to goodness going in the right direction because especially with, especially with this card right here, we're going to realize that your energy is going to start flowing and things are just going to be able to start working out, okay? So anyways, I'm Chris Vatic here and I also do private readings. I can do $75 for a... 50, a 60 minute Skype session reading, $50 for a 30 minute Skype session reading, and $35 for a private YouTube session, so we're kind of just like this, but for your specific need or issue. I'm also doing a sale this month. You're going to contact me at chrisinvatic at yahoo.com or chrisinvatic.com. Thank you guys so, so, so much for all your likes and your comments and your shares and subscribes. They've all been absolutely amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And, uh, and, 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 and thank you so much for listening to this video. Um, <coughs> uh, I hope, uh, I hope you guys have an absolutely wonderful, 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 wonderful October, okay? Bye!